Adventures of Greta and Lenore and more. The nerve. I can't. Honestly, who even still goes to something called a state fair anyway? Who goes to something like that? When I think of a state fair, now that is just for animals, right? Right. That is something where you bring animals. You people, bring a pig. People that like animals, they go, they watch animals. And then they like, they walk them around in like a little circle or something, right? I, I, I don't. And then they like bet money on them? I don't know. I've never grown up what? in a place where they had a state what fair. What human being? Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Offices of Anderson and Thompson Esquire, how may I help you? Oh, yes. Uh, this is Mr. Mr. Anderson, and you, you've been arrested, and you're looking for somebody to come and bond you out of the prison. I'm sorry, this, uh, correction, <laughs> this is Mr. Anderson's office that you are calling, so thank you very much for calling. Okay, great. Thank you. Honestly, Look Rebecca, you even if you went to something as stupid as a state fair, why would I want a t-shirt from that? In extra, extra large. large. I can't. I Ugh. feel like the nerve of her. She's hit an all-time high with me. I'm sick of it. What do I look like, a sumo wrestler? Apparently, I need to sleep in a tent. A cardboard tent at that. I mean, did you feel that thing? I thought to myself, how, how could I even possibly make this t-shirt cute? I could tie Can a little side knot like, the, yeah, like I, in I the can't. 80s. Offices of Innocent and Thompson Esquire, this is Greta speaking. How can I help you? Yes, no, we've already been over this. Mr. Off, mm -hmm. Mr. Anderson works here. He's not in jail. He's going to be in office any minute. Call back then when you're sir, actually Mr. Anderson. Yes, sir, we've already talked to you. Oh, my gosh. What, how can you even call? You he, know what she says to he me? He has the same name. Why would you call here? It's like, but she says to me, you can sleep in it. I'm sorry, Rebecca. Why would I want to sleep in this thing? Yeah, I have enough money because I have a job to buy a nightgown. A nightgown Thank and you. sleep like a normal person. Who's going to sleep in a cardboard tent? I did, oh my God. It felt like she honestly could have done some, a little bit of a favor. Just brought us one of the tent full of the animals back. And, and she would have said, have you're disgusting. You don't, know, you get that, uh, I'm still a little. Offices of Anderson and Thompson Esquire, how may I help you? Okay, you know what? I am, I am not a joke. You need to stop calling here. Stop fishing yes. us. We will not be catfished. That's what it is. And if this is some sort of sexual deviant crime, oh I God. am married and I am not interested. Ugh, the nerve. You know what? Rebecca has made my blood pressure so high. I think I might just like blast like a rocket straight to the ceiling. I really do. If you have some sort of attack, I'm going to hire Mr. Anderson to represent me because I have been wronged in your death. I think so. Against Rebecca. Thank you. Thank you, Lenore. Thank you. Honestly. Extra large t-shirt. I need to make a dentist there. appointment. Oh, that's a good idea. You think? 